Say goodbye to this beautiful quiff. Oh. oh my gosh, that feels weird. <laughs> Damn, I'm like sweating right now. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay. I mean, kind of, kind of should be. Mitchell Daly, Shell. I've been rocking this cup for a while now. Yeah. You even tried to grow it out a little bit. It sounds like you're Try sick of it. To. Are we buzzing it today? Yeah, I'm gonna cut it down and. Cut it down? Hopefully cut it my down hairline's buzzing not it. too bad. I don't know, but um, yeah, I'm gonna cut it down. Um, do you have any inspiration? I th you remember that one picture I showed you? I wanna go, I wanna do that again, like the, the first time we kind of did, just like a tad bit shorter than that. Let me see what you're talking about. Okay, I got this kind of. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it pretty much looks like you, so <laughs> let's do it. Uh, that looks like a, a one on this side, it's pretty high up. And that looks like a, maybe a two up top. Okay. Let's do, I always like to go short or longer at the beginning, especially on something that we haven't done before, and then we can always go shorter. Okay. So let's uh, let's just start right, start right yeah. down the middle, man. Do you, do you like the um, the fade on the sides? or Because I was thinking maybe, I want to see your opinion of just going like the same length, but I feel like I'd have to go really short if I wanted the same length all over. There should be a little bit of yeah. transition to like a taper okay. down to, to nothing, right? Gotcha. I don't, it doesn't need to be like a mid fade and then hair, it doesn't, I do myself like a little bit of length on the side, so it's less of a transition, but nonetheless, there's always a little yeah. bit of a taper just to the, the perimeter to get rid of any hairlines or whatever. Um, so we can keep it like a three, instead of being like a one, we can keep it a little longer uh, and then go from there. Okay. If it's looking like we should give it a little bit more of a, a transition, we can just dig in a, a bit harder. Oh uh, yeah, sounds good, because I just don't want it to be like, in a, you know, three, four days, it already starts to look kind of grown out. You know what I mean? I hear you. Yeah, so, so having a little bit of length, you buy yourself a tad bit more time. But yes, having a bit of a difference uh, in, in taper is, I think, pretty important. So yeah, say goodbye to this beautiful quiff. Oh. All right, so I got a three. I'm scared. Mm. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that feels weird. <laughs> so that guy had it like, like you said, just a tad bit over finger length. This is just under finger length. Okay. Most uh, buzz cuts are about a three down to... <laughs> Damn, I'm like sweating right now. <laughs> That's crazy. I like it so far. Yeah, your brother rocks something really short. He's fucking, he looks great. Shout out to Connor. Oh. Yeah, we didn't do this last time. Last time you like took it down and this time we're just going straight in. I've been wanting to buzz your head since you've been saying that you wanted to buzz I your head. Know. Let's fucking buzz your head, man. We're actually doing it. Yeah. Like a real buzz. Well, I, growing up I always had this. My since my dad's military. I just Did your dad cut it like this or did No, you? we went to the the PX and he just the the lady there just vroom, vroom, down to like oh, skin. Man, they do it fast. And yeah, it's like, quick, in and out, five minutes, get the next guy in the chair. Well, it's a good thing you look great in a baseball cap, too. <laughs> <laughs> With that drop fade I usually get, I was kind of always doing the, um, long on top, and then I would cut it down, cut it down, and then I was like, all right, I really want to cut it down, and then I'll grow back out again. And so, but this is the first time we've done like a super short, like real buzz cut. So we can do the slide and just leave a little bit of a, a little rat tail. <laughs> Slides growing out a Obi Wan Kenobi <laughs> rat tail. <laughs> All of us, yeah. Everyone grab their piece. <laughs> Why did you finally decide that this was the time to do it now? I mean, I just don't want to um, head to Kentucky like that. 
long hair and just be like, ah, oh, this kid, pretty boy. I just want to shave it off. Oh, you damn. Know? So, okay, that's a, some, some yeah. psychological warfare here. Yeah. No, I mean, it's, it's more for just, oh, this guy means business type thing. You know, not really like... I uh, I appreciate that you called it a pretty boy haircut. Yeah. Let's face it, it was. Uh, I've seen your Instagram. You're <laughs> you're a pretty boy. <laughs> now we're doing we're we're doing uh, <coughs> that Travis summertime Kelsey. summertime jump in the pool after you know. So this is a three and a half. I'm gonna taper it down to three, two, and uh, like I said, we'll see what that that makes your head shape look like, and then we'll just keep on going. Yeah, I'm definitely looking like a little egg right now. <laughs> it doesn't help that you have a lot of length on the sides. Yeah. As soon as we start shaping it up, you're gonna you'll start to see that the edginess starts to reveal itself. What you been up to this summer, man? Nothing much, just kind of working out, and I gotta be out of my apartment soon, so I gotta get the moving crew and start moving some stuff. But I'm not heading up there for a couple weeks, so stay with my parents for a couple weeks and then heading up there. What about you? You got anything going on? Yeah, we're heading out to the beach soon. Go do some fishing. I got a buddy who uh, just got a boat on the coast, and oh, nice. we'll try to catch some shark or something. I don't know, something cool. Yeah, it's no, it's no fun when you just go out there and just like throw a line and nothing happens. Like, yeah, uh, I don't like fishing. I like catching. Just saw Oppenheimer. It's a good movie. Oh, yeah, that was a. Uh, oh, it's long. That's been like the buzz of the the, the shop. We uh, we got guys who have seen Oppenheimer, love it, and then a bunch of them are going to Kenny and Jesse are going to go see Barbie soon. Really? <laughs> yeah. I want there to be, like I said, some shape. It was looking a little, yeah, a little round, and like I said, now we're starting to dial it in, so it has a bit of a bit more structure than just a. A single size, uh, single sized buzz cut all around. Those are great um, if you're going really, really short, but with a little bit more length up top, not quite finger length, still pretty aggressive. Um, yeah, having that difference in in lengths on the sides helps give your face a little bit more more shape. Nah, nah, I like it. I like it so far. I'm a little worried about this corner on the, the hairline a little bit, but besides that, I'm, I'm straight. I like it. It's a good thing you got light hair. Yeah. Yeah, if it was a, if it was dark hair like mine, yeah, you would see my recession all day long. <laughs> I pay attention. <laughs> I feel like only a pretty boy would know that. Yeah, to maintain that card, you gotta you gotta pay attention to things like that. <laughs> you, you, you ever never, like nobody ever like streaked across the field or? Oh, oh um, the A and M game. Yeah, some dude. I was up to bat, and some dude. Uh, it was like a huge A and M game because Texas A and M, you know, big rivalry. And um, I was up to bat, and this guy in only underwear comes like running like in from uh, from right field with like a Darth Maul mask on and I'm just like <laughs> I'm like trying to ice you bro on? yeah I'm trying to like stay focused on the at bat and he's running towards me I'm like is he about to like tackle me or something and um, you know thankfully he, he turned and just ran straight back to center field and <laughs> it was funny though so I'm just cleaning up the edges right now. Um, okay. I wanted to ask you if you wanted to do a low taper or if you want to just do a really kind of classic, just clean up on the edges, something a little bit more conservative. Uh, um, now that you're starting to see it on your head, you know, so you seem a little more aggressive down yeah, here. Yeah, I think I want to go, um, do you want to fade it or do you want to keep it like that? Like, what do you think? I think a little bit of a fade. All right, yeah, let's fade it a little. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to go like mid mid skin or anything like that. Just like a low taper. Keep it pretty, pretty classic. Okay, cool. Yeah, sounds good. I like that. And as the hair grows, it's. I mean, it's very rigid. It's very. It's very healthy. So it's going to grow in the direction that it wants to grow. So yeah. As you start 
like another half an inch, so about a month, you can start styling it, yeah. and it'll start to lay in a way that you put it. So if you train it forward, it's going to have a lot of hard time going backwards, but if you kind of push it around throughout the growing process, you'll weaken the hair shaft enough to, to be able to have some different styles as it grows out. The other thing is, like a great question, the uh, like, what do you what do you need to do as it's growing out? Start taking care of it. Like, still yeah. show it conditioner, still show it all that moisture because this is gonna be the oldest hair on your head eventually. And if you don't take care of it now, it's gonna you're gonna need the haircut to just like give it that healthy healthy look because it's all frazzled and, and dead ends are are starting to develop. So take care of it just like you had long hair. Gotcha. You don't have to use as much product. You don't have to do it as often, but um, or aggressively. But nonetheless, do a little bit of maintenance to it in this moment so that as it grows out, it grows out really lovely. Gotcha. I think we're cutting it off. I'm just going to just hack it all out. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, we're not allowed to at Texas. We're, we have to, we have like a clean shaven policy and we can't have long hair. So it's, we, like, the, it, it's like the Yankees, man. Yeah, it's like, Famous Johnny Damon. Yeah. Chopped all his stuff off. He had like the crazy beard, long hair, and he gets to the Yankees. You're like, who's that? Who's that guy with the same <laughs> name and number? Now that I'm at Kentucky, I was just like growing it out a little bit, kind of seeing what I like. But I think I like the clean shaven, no matter what. You know, <coughs> my brother has a full beard. Bob will tell you, he's he's got a nice beard, but yeah, good, good stuff. Yeah, I mean, I can't grow it like that yet. I mean. I just don't really grow around like the the top edges right here. Yeah, and like my mustache, it's kind of. Well, see, that, that's the thing is that you have a ton of hair there. That's yeah, your proper it's beard. weird. But because you, you your hair is so light, uh, yeah, it doesn't look like much. Yeah. If you were to let it grow out, hint, hint. Yeah. Maybe uh, maybe you can do something with it. This haircut reminds me of Chris Williamson from Modern Wisdom. I don't know who that is, but... <laughs> he's, uh, he's got this great podcast, man. Super, oh, really? super smart dude. Uh, he's been in my chair before, and I wanted to give him uh, a different haircut, but he was like, no, nah, we're going to do a three on top. He's going Easy to on the sides. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I mean, he's still rocking it, and he looks pretty good. Sometimes you just know what you, what you look good in. Yeah, you can see, you can see the difference already. <laughs> I can't see it, but yeah, sit, sit up. Yeah. So. Oh dang. Like, yeah. I haven't yeah, even touched the length. I haven't even touched the other anything. <laughs> I grew a mean neck beard. That's for sure. Jesse, you shut your mouth. Shut your f***ing mouth. <laughs> I always tell this story about my brother. My brother looks like he could be your brother more than, more than me. Yeah. And uh, he's got super light hair on his face. And uh, he was going to be my model for my barber test. And one of the things that the models have to have is hair to cut and a little bit of facial hair to, to trim, to shave. And he's like, dude, I can't grow facial hair, man. And it's like all blonde. And I was like, bro, you better start now. So he had to start like months in advance to get a head start. And uh, when he was in the chair, they allowed us to give him a goatee. So I gave him the stupidest goatee. <laughs> yeah, he, he was pretty pissed about that. But uh, yeah, he couldn't grow shit. And this was, uh, you know, this was almost 10 years ago now. And he can grow a little bit of a beard now, but. Now that he can finally grow a beard just because of his age and testosterone, he's a, a firefighter. So <laughs> now it's just about mustaches. Let's face it, firefighters have the best mustaches. It's definitely gonna be so much better, like working out and stuff, and not having to like come down your face and everything. It's just, it's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's not. It's not gonna, if you, uh, do anything, you know? it'll be easier just to wipe the towel over your head, but. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the sweat's still gonna be there, man. <laughs> if you're not sweating, you ain't working hard, hard enough. Yeah. I think you swallow these lines once a week. Yeah, um, definitely it's, you got a good guideline for sure.
I see what you mean, man. You look like you mean business. <laughs> yeah. Definitely uh, gives you a whole different look, you know? Oh, dude, you get to, get, you get to see that scar? That fucking Harry Potter scar? <laughs> Harry Potter oh, scar. Yeah. I'm gonna get some of our utility balm just to soften up the hair a bit. Get some shine, some love. Some beard oil, too. That's a great. To put in the hair? Yeah, just a small, light layer. Keep it, like I said, this is gonna be the oldest hair on your head eventually, once you stop cutting it. So having a little bit of that moisture and protection now is gonna pay dividends in the long run. Okay. 